This is a problem from NCRT, 17th problem from exercise 11.3. Before going to do this problem, please watch my video on uh, distance traveled by hour hand and minute hand. So now let us go to the problem. The minute hand of a circular clock is 15 centimeters long. How far does the tip of the minute hand move in one hour? Take pi is equal to 3.14. So underline the important words. Here uh, they have given the minute hand and circular clock. The length of the minute hand is 15 centimeters long. And uh, we have to calculate the distance traveled by the minute hand in one hour. So first to draw this figure. This is a clock. So this is a minute hand. The length of the minute hand is 15 centimeters. So see here uh, the minute hand travels from here to here in 5 minutes. This distance is 5 minutes it travels and uh, till here 10 minutes and till here 15 minutes. So it travels along this path. See here so till here 20 minutes 25 minutes like this 30 minutes 35 40 45 till 60 minutes. So it completes one circle in 60 minutes. So the minute hand uh, completes one circle in 60 minutes. So that is nothing but circumference of the circle. So minute hand travelled in one hour is one circumference that is 2 pi r. So 2 into here pi is 3.14 into r is nothing but the length of the minute hand. So 15 then 2 15s are 30 into 3.14. 30 into 3.14 is 94.20 centimeters. So the minute hand traveled in one hour 94.20 centimeters it travels. So suppose if they ask in two hours we just multiply this 2 pi r with 2. Suppose we want in 12 hours just multiply the circumference with 12. Suppose for one day we just multiply for one day means 24 hours. So multiply the circumference with 24. 